right? We need to be patient. Sometimes it takes time. All right, now we are inside the simulation environment. You can see we have in model palette mixers or splitters, separator, exchanger, columns. Okay, we go to reactors and we have stoichiometric reactor, yield reactor, equilibrium reactor, Gibbs reactor, CSTR, continuous stir tank reactor, black hole reactor, and batch reactor. We will use stoichiometric reactor. Left click, right? Just once. Now you can click this one to move here and there, right? Okay. So for example, if you right click, you have change section, move section, deactivate, data sheets, right? Copy, okay. So from here, we will use the material, okay? And we will make the feed stream and then the outlet stream, All right? Please be careful. Okay. Whereas this one will be deleted. Okay. So if you move your reactor, the stream will follow like this one. Okay. So you have stream one, S1, and you have S3. You can also rename S2, right? This is the reactor. You can call it V, and this one will be products. All right, so far so good. We have the reactor and we have the stream. Okay, now you can expand the stream folder, right? And then you can expand the feed stream and click this one in the feed. All right, so we are now inside the feed, feed material. This is the main flow sheet. We have another section in feed material, all right? We have mixed this one. Okay, so flash type, temperature, it is the pressure and then for the state variables, temperature. So as our case, 343, but in Kelvin, right? 343 in Kelvin, whereas the pressure will be in atmosphere. So let's find the atmosphere, one atmosphere. Okay, so for the total flow basis, it will be in moles. And the total flow rate will be 100 kilomole per hour, right? It's quite simple for now. And in composition, instead of mass flow or molar flow, we will find the mole fraction. Okay, this one mole fraction. Okay, so for the benzene, it will be 0 0.5. All right. And for the chlorine, 0 0.5 as well. And we don't have chlorobenzene or the HCl in the feed stream. Okay, so far so good. Temperature, pressure, state variables, right? And we can go to this one. If you are quite familiar with metric unit, you can use this one, metric unit or SI unit, right? It will change according to the unit system here. We will use the metric system. So we will have Kelvin atmosphere, kilomole per hour, right? All right, so far so good. Now we go to the next section, we click next. 